dramatically showed what we have said for years and months that there is money in Milwaukee County to build MCTS and not to always try to cut it down. That's right. Today we will talk about a fair contract, a better future for the transit system and community and, and we will hear from the community and public, uh, some of our public champions. There is a transit emergency and we will fight. We will fight for a new future for transit in this community. Let's start with a fair contract. Everybody knows that this is something that's right in front of us. And I'd like to first welcome Dar Darnell Short, uh, Shorter, ATU leader from the shops and our champion unifier. Yeah. Thank you, thank you. Brothers and sisters of 998, I just want to give you some examples how we're unified. You know, we work for a crazy company. We all got to deal with the same rules. Bumper days. When I, I talk to anybody else in the world, they don't understand a bumper day. And we're going through this over and over, year after year. It shouldn't be on the table at all. Um, Co-insurance. Chris Abley himself said yesterday that they saved money on the health care plan. They thought it was going to be higher. We told him that from the beginning. We've been talking 18 months we didn't need co-insurance. And he's saying we did. So in the end, I don't want him balancing my checks. I'll be in charge. No, he has enough money to make mistakes. Um, one of the other things I want to talk about is the holidays. Our management team has a different set of packages of holidays that we do. We're here at Christmas, dropping off our kids at daycare. We didn't walk you on Christmas Day. And they're, from, they're at home. They're at home Christmas Eve. They're at home the day after Thanksgiving, getting paid. They don't have to come in. Vacation days. We got to work here forever before you can split a vacation day up. And they can split theirs up in hours. They're here two, three days, and they're already taking vacation. So there's just so many things that unify us. I know I'm, I'm from the shop. And you guys, most of you guys here are drivers. You know, you get up at three in the morning, some of you don't get in bed until three at night. That's right. They don't understand that. They don't you know, care. So, they, so they walk a mile in our shoes, they'll never understand. We can do their job, but they can't do ours. Yeah, that's right. Thank you. Turn it on. All right, we have a interrupt the program for a special announcement of somebody who came all the way from Chicago. <laughs> 